17th of January 2022, the man of God, Prophet Fernando, saw five white men in a vision. One of them was standing on the altar, releasing powers to one of the four men. The one standing on the altar was looking like Adolf Hitler. At first, the man of God could not comprehend the vision until in three weeks' time of continuous prayers, when God clearly revealed to him the vision. These were his words. Yes, I would like to share uh, the vision I saw three weeks ago. Yes, that I would like to share with you today. Glory to Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yeah, God is revealing this in order to pray and to reverse the plan of the enemy against nations, against all uh, evil things they are planning against the lives of people. Glory to Jesus Christ. May the Lord bless you and bless you the more. And keep sharing the video and subscribe on our YouTube channel to support our ministry. Yes, this vision, I saw five men. In, in that vision, the five men, one of them was standing right like on an altar. He was standing on top of it. Yes, the other four were surrounding him. And now, the one who was standing on the altar was trying to, to release what he had uh, uh, to, to one of the four men who were close to him. And then I was watching a bit far, and then I just stood and watching their actions. Yes, so now, as I've been watching them, all of a sudden somebody just came next to me and he began to explain to me what I've been uh, watching. Then he said to me, you see the man standing on the altar is Hitler. So it's Hitler standing. Then I said to that man, I said, no, what I know, Hitler already passed away. He's not alive. That's what I know. Yes. So I've never seen Hitler in my life, but I saw the image of that man in my vision. And then uh, three weeks ago, then I began to I began to pray concerning this vision, to get the, the full understanding of this vision. How how could I see uh, it like my vision? Because it it's some someone that already passed away a long time. Then the spirit of the Lord made me understand the vision. Yes, and the spirit of the Lord said to me, the spirit that was using that man, it is going to start using another one in your time, your generation, right now. There is somebody is going to be used by the spirit that was in Hitler, the spirit that was in him, that was using him. Yes, right now I cannot mention the name of the person, but I have seen the guys close, standing. They were white people, yes, white, white men. That I saw them. So now let us all pray together. So the plan they are planning is they are going to use weapons to provoke war. Yes, in different countries to provoke war, and that war may destroy the lives of many people. Yeah, to kill a lot of people. We can now clearly confirm the man who has been given powers to provoke war in different countries. This will destroy lives of people. Let us watch and pray. The border check post of Sem Kivka, Ukraine's first line of defense against the Russian troops in Belarus, is just a mere yards away from Russia and Belarus. It's a highway to Kiev. So what is Ukraine doing to firm up its gates to avert St. Kivka from falling? More in this next report. The Russian war machine is digging in. No trenches or half measures. This is a full-blooded deployment. They've brought missiles, tanks, artillery guns. One command and they could swoop into Ukraine. All that firepower is deployed along this belt, the border between Ukraine and Belarus, around 1,000 kilometers long and right now a powder keg. 